There is a concerning update from the heart of Nigeria, Abuja. The once tranquil Federal Capital Territory is now grappling with a surge in kidnappings, sending shockwaves through its residents. Stay tuned as we delve into the details of this alarming situation and explore the efforts being made to address it. On January 7, 2024, kidnappers struck the Sangwari estate layout at Dutse in Buari Area Council, abducting 10 people. Tragically, some of the victims have been reported dead. Inspector General of Police Kayode Betokum assures that a comprehensive plan is in motion to rescue the remaining victims. But their families, friends, and indeed the whole country can't wait. Once known for its tranquility, Abuja is now engulfed in fear as kidnapping cases continue to rise. Residents are living in constant anxiety, demanding urgent action to restore safety. In a shocking incident, over 23 residents were abducted from Day Day Town, followed by another abduction in Bwakwe village. The surge extends beyond these incidents with terrorists abducting 85 individuals along the Kaduna Abuja highways. Sadly, more than four residents lost their lives during these attacks. Reports indicate that insecurity issues, including one chance occurrences and armed robberies, are becoming a daily reality in the capital. After the day day abduction, where residents were kidnapped by assailants, some posing as military personnel, a subsequent abduction of two children and nine adults occurred in Bwapi village, and several residents were taken in the Arab Road residential area in Kubwa town. In Katari, along the Kaduna Abuja Highway, terrorists abducted 85 people with reports of fatalities. Residents express heightened worries, urging authorities to address the escalating insecurity in the city. Teachers, traditional rulers, and villagers share their worries, calling for urgent government intervention, while they lament the transformation of Abuja from a safe haven to a precarious environment. FCT police assures residents of improved security measures, urging cooperation. Inspector General of Police, Kaide Ibetsukun, orders the deployment of officers and security equipment along the Abuja Kaduna Expressway to ensure the safety of travelers. As Abuja grapples with this alarming security crisis, the call for immediate and effective action grows louder. The safety of residents hangs in the balance and the need for a swift and comprehensive response from authorities is more pressing than ever. If you enjoyed this, please like, share and subscribe so you can get notifications.